This is a very quick um, video on the methodology I've decided to adopt rather than trying to do everything mathematically is to do it by trial and error. Uh, this, what you're seeing, is a matrix of the leg angles. Uh, the columns represent each of the 12 servos and the rows represent the 24 uh, individual moves that I've concocted to put together an individual step. So what I'm doing now is uh, using that uh, with the um, previous site code I've set up for spot <clears throat> so that if I if I press the right arrow it moves the servos one row forward press again it'll go one row forward again sorry my infrared's being dodgy again and then this way I'm just going through and matching the um, angles I've got this leg pretty well set up with the angles I want so it's just a matter of then going through with the other legs and then tweaking them uh, so we can see leg eight is a bit high so I can hopefully bring that down a bit and then just see what angle that is and then plug that into the matrix so um, that's the way I've decided to do it it's a bit slow and tedious but at least it's getting there so now I can just move through the um, individual moves now obviously all the legs don't work at the same time which is why I've set the matrix up, you may have noticed, with six forward steps and then 18 backwards. So that means that each leg will start at a, a six step delay to the previous leg, which will end up with the, um, the one leg forward, three legs back action that I spoke about previously. Anyhow, that's just a quick update on the methodology I've updated to. So I'll see you next time.